Hi, I'm Constantine, and this video is a little bit of information about another one of my deep dive programs called Path of Wisdom. And Path of Wisdom is a transformational journey through the 81 poems of the Tao Te Ching designed to explore your spirituality and cultivate a daily sense of awe with nature and your environment using the principles of Taoism and positive intelligence. So the Tao Te Ching is an ancient Chinese text. It's prolific in the world today. It's a book of philosophical poetry. It's only 5,000 Chinese characters, but that's six to 10,000 English words, depending on the English translation. And it's one of the top 10 most translated books in the world after the Bible. Positive Intelligence is a coaching method developed by Shirzad Shamin back in 2012, and it's focused on identifying your self-sabotaging behaviors and stepping into a wiser space from your inner sage. So these two structures work really well together. While the Tao Te Ching talks about this enigmatic character, the master or the sage, the positive intelligence model talks about tapping into your inner sage. So the program itself is 12 weeks long and it's built around the 81 poems of the Tao Te Ching, so 81 days and a little bit of change. Each week has its own theme built around the theme of the overarching collection of poems for that week. So week one, we're going to be focusing on the introduction to the Tao Te Ching and the Path of Wisdom program. And you'll be learning about the Tao Te Ching, its history, what it is, how it's influenced Chinese culture. And week two, we are going to dive a little bit more into positive intelligence, identifying your self-sabotaging behaviors and moving into a wiser sage mind and activating that inner sage along with the poems of the Tao Te Ching. Week three, we're gonna look at the power of non-action, Wu Wei, and getting into a flow state. And week four, we'll be doing poems 22 through 28, looking at uh, self-reflection and self-knowledge. Now that you've learned more about yourself, how can you integrate that a little more deeply? Week five is poems 29 through 35, focusing on the themes of yin and yang, and what those actually are and how they function in the world. The next week is cultivating virtue, with weeks 36 through 42 and what virtue actually means in the context of Tao Te Ching as a way of being, not as moral rectitude. The next week is focused on cultivating compassion for yourself and others in poems 43 through 49. And we're gonna be doing a little bit of challenging work, looking at the people who have maybe caused you the most harm and done the most damage in your life and cultivating a sense of compassion and forgiveness for them. And then in week eight, we'll be working on letting some of that go. We'll be looking at attachment, who, what, um, how are you attached to person, people, things, ideas, and how do they serve you and how do they harm you? And what's the relationship like, like with that? To so not necessarily let them go, but have a little more mindfulness and control over them. And the following week is The Nature of Change, poems 57 through 63. We're we'll looking at cycles of change like the seasons and your own personal cycles like daily, weekly, monthly, yearly, decade-long cycles. Week 10 is focused on the power of presence. So you're going to have a lot of mindfulness practices throughout this whole program, but in poems 64 through 70, we'll be cultivating a more uh, structured, <clears throat> excuse me, structured practice of meditation. Week 11 is focused on the nature of creation, and we'll be looking at life as a creative act with poems 71 through 77. We'll be tacking, tapping into new and old sources of creativity and inspiration for you. And to wrap it up in week 12, we'll be having poems 78 through 81 with a few extra days for integration, looking at life and death. The peak experiences of life and death, how they inform your view and relationship with them. So this program has a lot of benefits. Uh, we'll be cultivating daily mindfulness practice to experience awe as often as possible. We'll be cultivating connection with nature and environment through self, tapping into all the new sources of inspiration, creativity, overcoming self-sabotage, stepping into self-mastery. We'll be learning about the history of the Tao Te Ching and some Chinese culture and finding more purpose and meaning in your life. This is a 12 week deep dive program built around the 81 poems of Tao Te Ching, incorporating concepts from positive intelligence 
And if Path of Wisdom sounds like something that you're looking for, something that you're needing in your life, um, you can book a call. I encourage you to go to my website and book a free consultation so that you and I can chat about what this program can look like for you. I look forward to hearing from you.